it's uh, Dylan here. Um, I know it's Monday's Friday and today's actually Saturday and I realize I'm a day late but I told the guys I'd be a day late because yesterday I turned 18. Um, I'm now legally an adult which you know kind of scary. Not really you know ready for it. Um, this week's topic is life updates. What the fuck is my hair doing? Um, so I guess the biggest one is I'm not 17 anymore. I'm 18. Um, I just gauged my ears like literally five seconds ago. Um, I got my lip repierced. I got this new hat. Praise the platypus. Yes, I know I'm 18, but I act like I'm six. Um, went to my therapist. One Wednesday, um, told him, cause I'm trans, and he recommended me to go to the Mazzoni Center, and called them up and shit. And if I actually go, I can start testosterone by Christmas. But I don't think I'm gonna start going yet until I can get out of this house because my parents want to like murder me. For the fact they found out I went by Dylan at school. And they want to like kill me. So yeah. um, I'm working on legally changing my name. But I have to get a job first. I got a job interview on Monday. For a daycare. Um, I'm going to legally change my name to Dylan Jacob. Um, DJ. You know. Jacob. J. Dylan. Whatever. I don't give a fuck what you call me. But Dylan Jacob. Um. Probably, I'm not sure if I'm going to change my last name or not. I really don't like my last name. In case you know, my last name's Myers, so it'll be Dylan Jacob Myers, and I don't think I want to keep that. I think I'm going to take my best friend's last name. Because of the fact that my family's not accepting, but his is. But I'm not sure about that. Um, I could always take my friend's... Like I don't, I don't know. I don't want my last name, really, if they're not accepting of it anymore. Um, I had a girlfriend, we broke up, for the fact that her mom didn't want us together, and seeing as I turned 18 and she's only 15, I kind of had to listen, so I broke up with her for that, like, you know, whatever. Um, what else is happening in my life? Um, my mom actually been standing up for me more against my dad, which is pretty cool. I had a party yesterday for my birthday. Um, I got a lot of money, and with that money, I finally ordered another binder, because my mom took my other one again. Um, this time if she takes it, I can, like, flip shit, because I'm 18, so she can't fucking touch my shit no more. Um. Uh, I think I want to get my eyebrow pierced. I think that's what I want to get done next, because, you know, to lift the ears, I want this eyebrow done. They don't look cool, but you know, that's just me. Um, I'm actually surprised that I have my voice because I lost it all this morning. I didn't have a voice. And then all of a sudden, now that I'm making this video, they decide that I can have a voice. Oh, that's a brunch brighter. Um, I redid my wall. This is actually a new, new angle. Um, the one right here, that's the ex-girlfriend right there. This one. <laughs> and then, yeah, and all that stuff, so... There's that. Um, now that I'm 18, I can pretty much do whatever the fuck I want. I can stay out past 11. <laughs> um, buy some cigarettes. That's the first thing I did, even though I don't smoke. I bought them anyway. Just because, you know, I fucking could. I'll probably buy some, like, lottery tickets or some shit. I don't know. Um, I'm getting a new tattoo. I'm excited for that, actually. Like, extremely excited. I really want that. Um, school's going good, you know. Parents are still the same old assholes, you know. I think that's it, really. Like, my life's not that exciting. I've been sleeping a lot more. That's for sure. My ears kind of hurt. In case you really wanted to know. Which I'm pretty sure you didn't. My lip doesn't hurt though. My ears do this one though. This ear hurts a lot. This one's a bit bigger. 
And then this one. This is Lasani. And this. This video is so random because I have nothing to talk about because my life sucks and it's boring. Oh, my mom found out I was cutting myself again. She tried sending me back to the hospital. I refused. It was funny. <laughs> but I stopped again. I stopped doing that stuff. Like, like honestly, like, I can say it and laugh about it. Because I know how stupid I was being. And, like, like I know cutting isn't, like, a funny situation or anything like that. And, like, honestly, if you're doing it, come talk to me. Like, I'm completely, like, I've, I know it's an addiction. And that's why I'm having trouble with it. But it's, like, I laugh about it because I laugh about everything that sucks because it keeps me in a better mood. But, um, like, I hate, like, looking down at my arms and, and seeing the scars and stuff like that. But I have a fear of getting rid of them because I don't want to forget. But, um, if any of you guys are having trouble with anything like that, like, you guys can come contact me. Like, I've been through a whole bunch of shit with it. And, like, I can laugh about it. Because I laugh about myself all the time. Because it makes me feel better. And it puts me in a bunch better mood. But cutting yourself. And wanting to kill yourself. Is totally not a laughing matter. Whatsoever. And I know I, you guys don't really talk to me very much. Or like acknowledge me or anything like that. But honestly. I'm here for anyone. Anytime. I, I will fall asleep on Skype with you. If you're that bad. Um. I do it for people all the time, like, it's no big deal for me. I'll stay up at all hours of the night to make sure that you're okay, like, even if I never met you before. Um, I know how much it sucks, and how much you wanna, how much it sucks to wanna die, but I've made it through everything, I've made it through a lot, and, like, I know I don't have the worst life, but I also don't have the best life, and no matter what your situation is, you should never be embarrassed to ask for help because you may think that your situation's small, but compared to other people, but to you, it's your situation. And that was something I had to learn when I asked for help. So, yeah, it's just got like really depressing, but whatever. Um, my phone keeps going off, and I just keep looking at it like, go the fuck away. One thing I hate about birthdays. One thing. Facebook. Everyone posts on your wall, hey, happy birthday. I don't fucking know you. You would not know it was my birthday if it did not come up on the little calendar thing. You get, like, my phone vibrates, like, every five seconds on my birthday. And it's like, someone says post on your wall. And I'm sitting here like, who the fuck are you? And why the fuck you wish me happy birthday? But, you know, it's always nice, you know. Everyone wish you happy birthday. Um, the first person wished me happy birthday this year was text message with my friend Ashley on my wall hold on I'll go look I kind of want to figure it out that song has been stuck in my head all fucking day and I don't know why just in case you really wanted to know which you probably didn't the first person to wish me a happy birthday was Aspen. Oh, that's cute. He's sexy. <laughs> oh, he knows I think he's sexy. Anyway, yeah, this video is nine minutes and I don't know how long, and I just wasted ten minutes of your fucking life rambling about my stupid ass life. So, I'm gonna go now. Yeah, that was a really awkward face. I really don't care because I'm really hyper and I just woke up. Okay, goodbye.